For data collection and labeling, we're now going to use Unicode GUI. Let's open it and select our LSM 6DSOX from the device list. At this time, Profimams must be already connected to the USB port of the PC with the DIL24 inserted. First, sensor must be configured in order to stream data accordingly to our test case. For this specific application, an ODR of 26 Hz and a full scale of respectively 2G and 500 DPS should be used. At this point, we should be able to see data coming from the sensors as shown in the plot tab. We can now start to collect sensors data for each class previously defined. The load save tab of Unicode GUI has been designed to allow you to collect data with your profit maps and store logs easily. What we have to do is select acceleration and angular rate and get started with the logs. For each class, we are going to collect about 10 seconds of data. Remember that having many logs for each class is important in order to diversify your dataset. Be careful that logs should contain only the specific class related data. For example, if we are taking logs for steady class, we should not move at all the board from the beginning to the end of the process. We proceed in the same way for all the classes we have defined. Now that we have all the data logs captured and stored, we can move to the next step. One important thing to underline here is that data collection can be performed with different tools, for example, sensor tile. Anyhow, data logs format must be compliant with Unicode specification in order to proceed with the next steps.